Hey everyone, what is going on? It's Quinton here. Welcome to Young and Investing. Today is 24th of May 2018, which means that it's time for the monthly update again. And it's already monthly update number 14. And the timing is not really good, let's say, because uh, the last week we had a big correction in Bitcoin, but also, and more especially, actually, in, in altcoins, they lost even more value last week. So it's not real ideal to do, um, to do the monthly update right now, but it needs to happen. We cannot make an exception to do it a little bit later. So uh, let's get started. Um, so there are a lot of changes um, that happened last month in my portfolio. I did some updates. Um, I'm still thinking to do some more updates uh, the coming months um, in my portfolio because I'm still not really 100% happy and I see other opportunities popping up which are better than some that I'm holding right now. So uh, that is why I'm thinking about uh, changing even more in my portfolio. So uh, let's get started with the sell right here. Which, did I, which uh, coins did I sell this month? Uh, first of all, Dragon Chain. I sold 10,000 Dragon Chain um, and also 25,000 Substratum. I told you guys about that. Um, uh, I, I want to, to make sure that you guys um, don't think that I don't believe in these projects anymore. I sold them because, as we could see the previous month, um, the weight of these two were actually a lot in my portfolio. Um, as you could see right here, my these two were my biggest altcoin holdings. So uh, it was just for that specific reason that I sold some of uh, my Dragon Chain and my Substratum. Eventually, it turned out to be pretty good to sell these two because these were the um, my biggest losses of last month in terms of percentage. So uh, I wasn't, I think, a bad decision to sell um, these to lower my weight and also because they lost a lot of value last month. I also sold some Bitcoin, so 1.3 Bitcoin um, to buy into some ICOs. So in total, I, um, I sold uh, cryptocurrencies worth over $40,000 and I bought three new things. So the first thing is Tron. In the beginning, uh, of Tron, I was also not really a believer of the project, especially because it got hyped up so much, uh, not only by the CEO, uh, which, which which was a lot of things to do about that, uh, but also about this entire community. It was such a hype, Tron. But I changed my mind, and I think it's very important uh, as a good investor to be able to change your mind and um, just make your decisions based on your own opinion and not like based on what you thought uh, some months ago but what it is right now and i think tron is a very good project it has an awesome ceo uh, the team is just incredible it's one of the biggest teams it's even that, that, that big as ethereum um, also i think that they will launch their mainnet um, in a few days and uh, together with their mainnet, they will also launch a lot of already users of their mainnet. So they have some partnerships. Um, and in total, there will be more than 100 million users already on their uh, mainnet from the beginning. So that's also pretty cool. But I have so much more reasons why I do believe in Tron right now. Um, but I will make a separate video about that, but just want to explain that a little bit. Then Ethos, I also bought Ethos. Uh, you guys know that I believe in the project. I did an interview with uh, one of the top people of Ethos. Um, I do really think this is the best wallet out there and uh, could be really a competitor to, for example, Coinbase. Then I bought into an ICO, which is Eden Chain. And Eden Chain only did like a private sale. I told you guys about Eden Chain in uh, my top three ICOs for this month. So I did this video last month, the end of last month. I told you guys about Eden Chain. Um, a lot of people wanted to buy into it, but like I said, it was only for private investors, and I and I managed to get in uh, into the private sale. So I bought uh, 20 Ether worth of uh, Eden Chain tokens. Uh, so that's pretty cool and the price of ether got packed at 750 dollars so with the current price of 595 or something this is a good thing for me because the price is packed higher than it is right now so that is pretty cool and uh, with this 
I actually bought these three new things um, with the Dragon Chains of Stratum and Bitcoin that I sold. For the rest, my portfolio pretty much stayed the same. Um, I also revealed that I bought into Mainframe, which was this mysterious private pre-sale of the last two months. So uh, also in the private sale, because there was no main sale for uh, Mainframe, um, with some contacts, I managed to get into the ICO. I bought for 10 Ether worth of mainframe tokens, which will be distributed, I think, in the beginning of uh, next month. So really looking forward to these two ICOs, which I bought in. I really do believe most in Eden Chain. Um, I think this is a potential uh, times, let's say, times 40 easily. Um, and I think even for when the when the tokens are going to exchange, there is a good chance that it already will go times four, times five, maybe uh, from ICO price. So we can have some good profits already with this Eden Chain ICO. But I will hold it a little bit longer because I do really do believe in the entire concept of Eden Chain. So uh, my current portfolio, what does it look like? Eden Chain, Mainframe, Tron, Ethos. And for the rest, it stays the same. HPB, Dragon Chain, CargoX, INT, NEO, Bitcoin, NEM, Substratum, Black Moon. It's a big portfolio I have right now, but I don't mind. But I'm still thinking to sell some things. So let's see of the price change this month. Uh, we see that uh, Tron and Ethos compared to um, to what I to a month ago to where I bought. Tron didn't change, so it's exactly 0%. I bought it at 7 cents, it's right now at 7 cents, so it didn't do anything uh, since I bought, and I think that's a month ago. Um, I think 25th of April I bought them. So um, Ethos, uh, minus 35% from last month, HPB, minus 25 Dragon Chain, as I said, one of the biggest losses in terms of percentage, minus 54%. Cargo X minus 50%, INT minus 42%, NEO minus 36%, Bitcoin minus 20%, NIM minus 37%, Substratum minus 47%, and Black Moon minus 12%. So Black Moon also pretty stable this month. Uh, we see that it was a very bad month. I think you guys can already guess that by just seeing these numbers right here. These numbers are just revealing that it was a very bad month again um so what was it worth on april and what it's worth on in may i think i have a more balanced portfolio right now as i said i sold some substratum and dragon chain because it was a little bit out of balance so i'm more happy with how it looks like right now i have one two three four five actually uh let's say four altcoins that are close uh, in range of price of, of word of value in my portfolio. And then I have Bitcoin with a higher value than all the rest. So I'm pretty happy with how it looks like the balance right now, but I think I still will, will change some uh, cryptocurrency holdings right here. So the monthly change for month 14, uh, we see minus 77, but that is because I sold some Dragon Chain. So I sold 50% of it. Uh, also substratum minus 69 and all the rest stays the same except for bitcoin because i also sold some bitcoin but the rest is the same as the price change so what is my portfolio worth right now this month uh, on 24th of may 2018 it is worth uh, 131 thousand dollars that's more or less identically the same as um what it was worth right here at month 12 so after year the yearly one update um so we see that it's more or less the same then it went to 184 thousand last month and now it's back at the same level as two months ago uh so the monthly change minus 29 percent um that's not the good but if we look to the market cap, we see that it's not that bad. I hold I hold a lot of altcoins, so it is normal that uh, the value of my portfolio goes down more than the market cap because the market cap is especially Bitcoin, and Bitcoin is the most stable one. Um, so I think 29% compared to a market loss of 23% is pretty much okay. We see that the market cap went from 422 billion to 325 billion which means 23 percent so uh it's five percent more loss 5.5 5 
than um, than the market cap loss of this month. So that is the monthly update for this month. Um, I hope that next month is a little better. I hope Eden Chain will um, will go to the exchanges, and I hope to get some profits that way um, to hopefully have a green month again and hopefully we don't go even lower um than we are right now in cryptocurrencies but i think it would be surprising if we go a lot lower because we already had a correction of 20 plus percent in one week of bitcoin and the altcoins even 30 percent or more in one week so it would be surprising that it would go even lower the next few days i expect a bounce to be honest with you guys so that is what my portfolio looks like right now uh, next month we're back with monthly update number 15 which will be on 24th of june 2018 when the world cup is going on i'm really looking forward to the world cup i think you guys as well let me know in the comments down below which team you are supporting by the way of course i am supporting belgium i hope we will be world champions but i think that it won't work because it's a little bit difficult with uh, the competition if i see the other countries so guys thank you so much for watching uh give it a thumbs up if you like my monthly updates and leave a comment down below if you want to ask something say something or want to let me know which team you're supporting for the world cup as i said guys thank you so much cheers bye bye